is in the books. It culminated with a Monday night affair in the AFC South in Jacksonville. Vince Young on your left, David Garrard on the right. Titans and Jaguars a chance to stay with the top of the pack. Houston and Indianapolis in the division. First quarter, no score. Play action. Vince Young going deep down the left side for Bo Scaife. Picking up 33 yards. Two plays later, first and 10. Young to Kenny Britt, fighting his way into the end zone for the 23-yard score. And the Titans off to the 7-0 lead. Yeah, Tennessee's good, but Kenny Britt's consistent, catching the football and playing determined. Next Tennessee possession on second down. Young fumbles, which recovered by Aaron Campman. And you'll see on the replay, Young kind of gets twisted, uh, twisted down to the field. Jeff Fisher would challenge saying that Young recovered the ball and was down before he fumbled again. But uh, the concern here on that left knee of Vince Young. The play would be reversed. Tennessee's ball as Young would walk off the field with the knee injury. Kerry Collins would come into the game at the quarterback position, but the Titans would punt on that drive. They continue to work on Young on the sideline. Second quarter, same score. Jacksonville would take over the football. This is a third and 15 play. David Garrard under center, throwing deep down the middle to Tyquan Underwood, but it's picked off by Michael Griffin. And Griffin is taking it back to the Jacksonville 37. Uh, miscommunication between Underwood and David Garrard. It's supposed to break that off. That's what David thought. Interception. Ensuing Tennessee possession. This is third and short. Collins throwing left, hit skate for the 12-yard pickup all the way to the Jacksonville 1. Three plays later, third and goal, Collins throwing left, and Michael, you said it, he just kind of felt his way easily against this Jacksonville defense. It's pitch and catch for Curry. He's a veteran guy. He knows what's going on out there on the field. Tennessee would take a 14 to nothing lead. Jacksonville's next possession, third and four. Garrard hit as he uh, throws, and it's incomplete, trying to find Mercedes Lewis, and Garrard here looks like he's hurt. Yeah, they, you know, the initial thought, it looked like it'd be a shoulder injury at first. Later, the report was concussion from, from the hit going down. Or as if we didn't have enough vicious hits in the NFL in week six, one more quarterback and player goes down. So Trent Edwards, just three weeks into his career with Jacksonville summoned, and it didn't go well for him. Third quarter, pass intended for Underwood. It's picked off by... Uh, Verner there on the sideline. He's ruled down at the Jacksonville 33. Tennessee would kick a field goal on the drive to go up 20 to nothing. Fourth quarter, Jacksonville looking for anything offensively. Maurice Jones drew for the 11-yard pickup to the 45-yard line. Two plays later, Edwards to Mike Thomas for the 20-yard pickup. They would continue to move 13 plays later. This is fourth and goal. Edwards trying to get it to Underwood. It looked like it was there, but it's picked off. By Vincent Fuller. Yeah, interesting, two, interesting hurry up drive. They ran the ball. They did actually Tennessee a favor by milking the clock on that drive. Tennessee gets it back, trying to put the game on ice, and they did exactly that. Chris Johnson, <laughs> 35 yards for the touchdown, and the Tennessee Titans cruising their way to a 30 to three victory. If they really wanted CJ to get those yards, yeah, they, didn't they? Yeah, I mean, did you see, did you see the clock? Did you see where they were in that ball game, 23-3? Yeah. They really wanted him to well, have those yards. Jack Del Rio called timeouts. So if you're going to call See, timeout, timeout, you're going to get go ahead, go ahead. a chance to get a buck 11. And he got us 100. So that's what you're going to do. No timeouts. They would have never had a chance.